There's an interesting debate in the Talmud as to what is the most important verse in the Torah. One opinion is that it's the Shema Yisrael. Another is that it's love your fellow as yourself. And the third opinion is it's on the day that God created man, he made him in his image. But although those are all super important, the winning verse was one from this week's Torah portion. One lamb shall you offer in the morning, and one in the evening. How strange. A verse about sacrifices is more important than anything else in the entire Torah? The Rebbe explains that while loving our fellow is crucial, as is the Shema Yisrael, which declares our complete, unwavering faith and trust in Hashem, and knowing that we're created in the image of God is also so important. As that's what gives us this, the push, strength to live a godly life. And it's even possible to carry those mitzvahs, if need be, with self-sacrifice. What's most challenging is to do these mitzvahs with consistency, day in, day out. Thus, the Talmud tells us that what's most important is that we do them with the same zest every day, Babukar in the morning, representing when things in our life are going well, and Benahar Baim in the evening, when things in our life may be getting dark and we are not going and not doing so well. We must still lovingly do the mitzvah, even if it takes sacrifice. Of course, this is easier said than done, but this verse is so important that not just do we read it from the Torah every Rosh Chodesh, but we read it every day in our prayers in the morning before Shachrit and again in the afternoon before Mencha, reminding us that what's most important in our relationship with Hashem is to try our best to keep that relationship up in good times and in not such good times, consistently and with love. We may, may we learn from our relationship with Hashem and apply it at home with those we love, that we be there for them through thick and through thin, with that same consistent love, care, and devotion may be in good health, infused with happiness, prosperity, and abundance of good.